Leonardo da Vinci. There are a certain number of artists, creators, and thinkers who leave a centuries-long impact on human history. I'm sure you can think of some of them right off the top of your head. Some of them include Michelangelo, Isaac Newton, and even Steve Jobs. Yet there is one individual who has achieved so much in the worlds of art and science. You've likely heard of him. His name is Leonardo da Vinci. Da Vinci is one of the most intelligent people to have walked our earth. His works and thoughts still captivate people around the world. From the Mona Lisa to da Vinci's early designs for a flying machine, his life can be summed up in one word, fascinating. An unrivaled thinker and creator, da Vinci was born in the year 1452 in Vinci, which is a small town in Italy. In his early life, da Vinci was educated by Andrea del Verrocchio, who was a painter in Florence. Compared to schools today, artists and creators in the Renaissance era apprenticed under a master. Doing so, they can learn from the master's successes and mistakes as they created their personal artistic style. Da Vinci was known as a Renaissance man, despite having no formal education. This is the sort of person that is an expert in many different areas. After learning from his master, Verrocchio, da Vinci showed off his talent in cities like Milan, Rome, Bologna, and Venice. When going through these cities, da Vinci was hired by different powerful individuals to craft different types of works. He is most known for his paintings, but da Vinci was also a sculptor, scientist, and architect. Along with these engagements, da Vinci would experiment and take detailed notes in his famous notebooks. His life was absolutely fascinating, even beyond his creations and discoveries. In fact, for two years of his life, da Vinci was missing from 1476 to 1478. Few primary sources recorded da Vinci's activities. Some believe that da Vinci went to a cave where he discovered aliens. According to the theory, he wrote about his discoveries in those notebooks. While the theory hasn't been proven, it goes to show that da Vinci lived a life unlike many others. Were these extraterrestrials that he met in the cave or just a drawing from his vivid imagination? You decide. Da Vinci's Most Famous Works When talking about Leonardo da Vinci, much of the conversation centers on his works and inventions. His works were timeless and his inventions were ahead of his time. He had the unique ability to make beautiful works and thought-provoking inventions that continue to captivate us. In any discussion of Leonardo da Vinci, you have to talk about the Mona Lisa. The Mona Lisa is da Vinci's most famous work and the most popular painting in human history. The Mona Lisa in Italian is called La Gioconda, which means the laughing one. The woman painted in the Mona Lisa is thought to be Lisa Gerardini, who was a noblewoman in Italy. Da Vinci first began working on the Mona Lisa in the year 1503. He worked on it for three years, and some believe that he actually completed the work in 1517. Arguably, the most famous part of the Mona Lisa is her face, which contains an elusive smile. The dramatic landscape behind is also one of the more striking parts of the Mona Lisa. If you can travel to Paris to see the Mona Lisa in person, I definitely recommend it. You can find the Mona Lisa in the Louvre Museum. Along with the Mona Lisa, one of da Vinci's most famous paintings is The Last Supper. The Last Supper is a painting that shows the last meal that Jesus had with his disciples. Da Vinci was hired to make this painting for a church in Milan, Italy. The Last Supper is one of the world's most recognizable paintings. It is found in the Dominican monastery, Santa Maria della Grazie, in Milan. It depicts the dramatic scene described in several closely connected moments in the Gospels, including Matthew 26, 21 through 28. At the center of the painting is Jesus, right before he says that one of his disciples will betray him. According to Leonardo's belief, each of the 12 disciples reacts in a manner that fit that man's personality. Unfortunately, little of the original painting remains. This is because of wear and tear and the passage of time. The Vitruvian Man is based on Di Architettura, a building guide written by Roman architect and engineer Vitruvius between 30 and 15 BC. It discovers the geometry of perfect proportions. Even though it isn't strictly a painting, da Vinci's Vitruvian Man is also a classic. 
The Vitruvian Man is a drawing of a man in two superimposed positions. The man's arms and legs are separated and are within a circle and square. Ultimately, the drawing is important because it shows da Vinci's understanding of mathematics, art, and proportion. Experts also argue that the Vitruvian Man is one of the most important drawings that show man's relationship to nature. Da Vinci's art and drawings alone would make him one of the most influential creators in history. That being said, he didn't stop there. Da Vinci was known as a forward-looking inventor who came up with concepts and ideas that we continue to see today. As just one example, da Vinci's notebooks include inventions for things like musical instruments, hydraulic pumps, mortar shells, and a steam cannon. One of his most fascinating concepts was his earlier designs of a modern-day helicopter. While it doesn't look like much like the helicopters we see today, da Vinci wasn't far off in thinking of how science and technology would change our world. Ultimately, much of da Vinci's knowledge can be found in his famous notebooks. He used his notebooks to not only think about creations he was working on, but think about life as a whole. Clearly, da Vinci was a thinker beyond his time. Even in the year 2020, it's safe to say that he was one of the most remarkable humans that ever walked our planet. One of the most fascinating people in human history. In all likelihood, there will never be another person like Leonardo da Vinci. He was such a talented artist, sculptor, architect, and designer. He truly fits the label of Renaissance man. But even beyond his works that we continue to enjoy, his life was absolutely fascinating. From studying under great artists to perhaps discovering aliens, da Vinci was an unbelievable person. Whether you're looking at his pieces of art or the forward-looking ideas in his famous notebooks, I'm sure you can say the same. Simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. Please comment below and tell us how you liked our video. See you soon! Please subscribe to my YouTube page for more fun videos. everybody and follow me from the beach to the cove or in the sea it's time for learning it's time for fun it's a great adventure for everyone come on everybody and follow me jump and swim out to the bottom of the sea it's time for adventure fun and learning scuba jack it's a shark attack Hey everybody, it's Miss Beth from the Adventures of Scuba Jack. Please comment below and give us a thumbs up if you liked our video with Activity Book. See you soon.